Hello, boys and girls. Pastor Sam here, and I have another Bible hero for you this Sunday. wonder if I can get him in the shot. Nope. My son Paul is here, so if you see somebody scampering around, that's him. Oh, there he is. There we go. Paul's here with me. We have our Bible hero for today. Now, last week we heard about Joseph, who was the earthly guardian, kind of the stepfather of Jesus. Now, this week we have Jesus' mother. Her name is Mary. Now, Mary is actually Jesus' mother. She was pregnant with Jesus and gave birth to Jesus. And today we're going to hear the story of when Mary finds out that she is going to be Jesus' mother. Now, Mary was alone one day. She was just doing her normal thing. And all of a sudden, an angel appeared to Mary. Now, when angels appear to people, they're usually very frightened. The people are frightened because the first thing that angels say is, do not be afraid. So the angel said to Mary, do not be afraid. I have good news. The angel said that Mary was highly favored by the Lord. Now, Mary was a little bit curious. She had never seen an angel before. And she didn't know what kind of message this angel had for her. The angel said that God was very happy with Mary, that Mary would become pregnant, and that she would give birth to the Son of God. Now, Mary was very confused because normally it takes a mom and a dad to have a little baby, but Mary was just a mom all by herself. She was very confused, and she asked the angel, how is this going to happen? And the angel told her that the Holy Spirit would come upon her and would cause her to become pregnant, and that she would give birth to a baby boy, and she was supposed to call him Jesus, because he would save his people from their sins. And Mary believed the angel, and she sang a song that we still sing today sometimes. It's called the Magnificat. That is a big word, Magnificat. And it starts out, my soul magnifies the Lord and my spirit rejoices in God my Savior. And sometimes we sing that a few times because we too can rejoice in all of the wonderful things that God has done. Just like Mary rejoiced when she found out that she would give birth to little baby Jesus. We're going to pray. We are going to thank God for Mary, and we're going to thank God for all mothers. So pray with me. Dear God, thank you for Mary and all mothers everywhere. Amen. Maybe you heard Paul praying with me. He loves to pray, and I hope you love to pray too. I will see you eventually, and you will get oh so many Bible hero cards when you see me next. Until then, God's blessings.